Hey folks, Ray from LoveYourRV.com. Well, it's an exciting day for us today. We just got a new mattress come by UPS from Lippert Components. Uh, fair disclosure, they gave me this mattress for free for review. I did actually have to pay tax in Canadian brokerage at the border. But we're pretty excited because we're still sleeping on the original mattress of this uh, 2011 Cougar. We've used some uh, foam toppers over the years, but it's been getting pretty ratty. So I was really excited when Lipper offered this. This is our new Thomas Payne foam mattress. So what they say I have to do is unroll it and let it uh, expand for 24 hours before I can install it. I think I'm going to do that out here in the little screen room that we have. Another thing that Lippert sent was a screen room. If you want to see any of the, the products I've been reviewing, I was uh, accepted as a brand ambassador, they call it. So I've been reviewing a lot of the Lippert component products and I've set up a playlist, so I'll link to that. Anyway, let's get this puppy unrolled and see how it looks. Okay, there we go. So it came rolled up in two layers of heavy plastic. So I've undone the first layer and kind of left the the other layer on and then opened it up and it's already starting to expand. Let's see this is supposed to be a expand to a 10 inches in height and ours is a short queen so we're I think 74 inches long and 60 inches wide. I'm gonna let it expand out here because I have enough room through the doorways I can take this in even when it's expanded but the rolled up aspect of it is if you need to get it into a tight space, you can take it into the bedroom first. But they say about 24 hours to expand fully. So I'm going to leave this out here all day and then I'll probably leave it in the living room for the, the night and then we can install it tomorrow. Stay tuned. Day well, I let it expand all day yesterday. Then last night we brought it inside and let it sit in here. Um, as far as smell goes, a lot of these foam mattresses will smell for a while. We haven't really smelled too much at all, so I think we're going to lay it down on our bed today, let it finish expanding, and we'll be able to test it out tonight. See some tags here. This one says, Made for Lippard Components, Inc., manufactured by Vietnam Glory Home Furnishings Company. Data manufactured June 2020. Cover made in China, filled and finished in Vietnam. So this is the bottom side of it. Maybe I'll just unzip this and give you a look at what the foam looks like. It's a 10 inch mattress, supposedly. There we are. So it's still expanding somewhat. So you have a nine inches of dense foam material. And then this top layer is the memory foam. And it's infused with charcoal, and it's made to uh, sleep cool. The cover can zip off. It's kind of got a little thickness to it as well. Kind of a terry cloth feel. And here's where it's going. It's going to replace this. See what we've been using. We've been using a couple... Uh, foam toppers, two of them in fact, and then there is the original mattress that came with the Cougar, it's kind of a spring mattress, really kind of cheap, you can see it's well used, so we'll pull that out and put our brand new mattress in there. There's a difference in thickness, I weighed this one and it comes in right around 40 pounds, this one is right around 50, so it's adding 10 more pounds, although the two toppers weighed about 10 pounds, so kind of an even trade-off. I just hope this thick one works okay with our... Uh, we have a bed that lifts up, so we have uh, storage underneath. There's some shocks that help it lift. I think it'll work okay. There we go. Fits perfectly. Let's see if that will open now. Oh 
yeah. That works. Uh, it looks like there might it kind of comes out an inch. Might have to push it back when we drop it, but at least that's working. Okay, so we'll spend a few nights uh, sleeping in this thing and uh, come back and let you know how it went. For me, I'm a pretty good sleeper. I can almost sleep on anything, but uh, Anne will be the true test. She'll let you know uh, how she likes it. Should be a lot better than what we were sleeping on, though. So let me go through some of its top features before I come back with our opinion of it after we've used it a little while. Uh, this is the Short Queen that we got. It's also available in Queen, King, Short King, and Narrow King. You got a one inch top layer of 2.2 pound memory foam infused with charcoal cooling gel and then nine inches of comfort and support base layer at 1.56 pound foam. Uh, so smart temperature moisture wicking materials. Uh, it's got an EcoFlex fiberglass free mattress barrier. Ships compressed and double bagged in a box for added protection. Fits on any flat, secure surface like box spring, slatted bed frame or floor. It's got a six month compression guarantee and a 10 year warranty. Well, Anne and I have had several nights sleep with the new mattress, and overall we're quite happy with it. Uh, fit into our RV really well. Uh, no problems there. It's a little bit higher than our original mattress, but that's not a problem at all. Uh, we slept quite cool. No problem. Was, last night it was pretty warm, and there was no problem with overheating, which some foam mattresses you can have a, a problem where it gets too hot. Uh, the support is really good with this mattress. Really, that dense foam gives you lots of uh, back support. And hardly any smell. After 24 hours, we put it in and haven't really had any problems with smell. You know, some of these foam mattresses can smell for quite a while. Some people can't use them for a week. Uh, the Short Queen sheets fit nicely. Let me just give you a look at that. These are some Short Queens, so they fit really nice. <clears throat> Easy to put on and everything. Uh, so far, the only issue I've had with it is that it does seem quite firm. It seems to be uh, softening up a bit, especially as that top layer of foam expands. The first night, I found it a little firmer than the next two nights. It seems to be softening up. But uh, if you don't like a really firm mattress, this might not be for you because it is fairly firm. I almost think they could maybe add a bit more memory foam that... It has a little bit of memory foam, that gel memory foam layer at the top is only one inch. I think maybe an inch and a half or two inches would be a little bit better. But that's kind of a, a minor complaint. I actually like a firm mattress myself. Pricing on the mattress is pretty decent, I'd say. Uh, it goes for $389 US dollars, and, and on their website it says free shipping to the lower 48. Uh, I got it shipped up here to Canada, and on the the uh, through the customs brokerage, they charged, UPS charged uh, taxes and brokerage that came to $144 Canadian. And the exchange rate was $521. So for a Canadian ordering this, you're looking about $665. Just so my fellow Canadians know the deal on that. Anyway, like I say, we're uh, pretty impressed with the mattress and quite happy to have it, especially compared to that old mattress we had before. Uh, if I have any problems, I'll be sure to update you. I plan to do a, a roundup of all the Lippard products I've reviewed this summer, probably in a couple months. Like I say, I like to use things for a while and come back with a, a review in case things crop up. But overall, I think this mattress is going to be a, a, a welcome addition to the, the RV. Till next time, Ray from LoveYourRV.com. Cheers, everyone. What do you think, Snoopy? Is it good? Yeah, right. Really good mattress.